The Crucial X10 Pro and the Samsung T9 both offer really fast speeds up to 2100 megabytes a second, but they both also require the use of USB 3.2 Gen 2 dual lane capabilities in order to get these faster speeds. And in this video, we're gonna compare both of these drives and discuss when you should choose to buy the Samsung and when you should choose to buy the Crucial. Now, I wanna start this video off by saying Crucial did send me the X10 Pro for purposes of making some videos, but all the thoughts in this video are my own. They have no say in it. I did buy the Samsung T9 with my own money, and I've been using both of these for a little bit now and have a couple thoughts on the differences between these two drives. Unfortunately, if you have a Mac, you're not gonna be able to take advantage of the dual lane speeds. And doing some tests on my 14 inch Mac, the speeds came out to be very similar. Although on the X10 Pro, I did seem to get a more consistent speed across both the read and write. The Samsung T9 does not have an IP rating, but it does have a drop rating of up to nine feet. The Crucial X10 Pro has an IP rating of 55 and it has a drop rating of up to seven and a half feet. If you compare both the drives side by side, you'll notice that the Samsung T9 is definitely considerably bigger than the Crucial X10 Pro but they both are still pretty compact when it comes to external SSDs. You can also buy both of these drives in one, two, and four terabyte configurations, and I've been testing the two terabyte versions of both. Samsung and Crucial also both give you a five-year warranty on their drives, and they both include a USB-C to USB-C cable, but the Samsung drive also includes a USB-C to USB-A cable. I also wanna mention the Samsung's USB-C to USB-C cable is quite a bit longer than the Crucial's, but I find that the crucial length is a little bit more appropriate for my desktop setup. Although the Samsung one is nice when I wanna use it to charge other devices. So after comparing the features of the drives, they're priced pretty similarly, although usually the crucial drive is cheaper than the Samsung drive. Now I recommend checking the links for both of these drives in the description below, because the price is gonna vary quite a bit depending on what the capacity of the drive is and what sales are going on. I've just found that SSD prices can be all over the place, so it's really hard to know what the price is gonna be when you're going to buy a drive. If I was gonna choose between these two drives, I would probably choose to buy the Crucial X10 Pro because it's usually cheaper than the Samsung and it's also significantly smaller. So it's just gonna take up less space in your gear bag. Also, the Crucial has the IP rating and the Samsung does not, but the Samsung does give you a little bit better of a drop rating. Since both of these drives are still fairly new, it is hard to say without a shadow of a doubt which one will last longer but I plan on continuing to use both the X10 Pro and the Samsung T9, and if I have any issues with either of these drives, I'll be sure to update the description so you can be up to date on the latest information on my experience with the drives. If you're interested in buying either the X10 Pro or the Samsung T9, I have links in the description below. If you have any other questions about these drives, leave a comment down below and I'll do my best to answer them. Like this video, subscribe to my channel so that you can help boost this video into the magical algorithms.